what really surprised me is the numbers of people who are traumatized. You have whole communities traumatized, whole towns traumatized, and also the lack of attention to mental health care. We're now moving into a peace building phase and you cannot achieve peace till people are emotionally healed. And I think that mental health trauma support should be at the fulcrum of any peace building effort because without that, I think uh, psychology and trauma healing is the way to get communities to reconnect because we're trying to put together both sides in the community. Uh, some are victims, some are perpetrators, some are families of victims, some are families of perpetrators. And the truth is that everybody has suffered. Everybody has a mental health story. Everybody has a trauma journey uh, when you talk to people in the Northeast. And unless they can access and heal that trauma, they can't do some of the other hard work that we want them to do, the forgiveness, the reconciliation. That has to come secondary to healing the people first.